Phonics chart 12. Does anyone remember at least one of the prefixes we learned? Remember a prefix goes at the beginning of a word. Does anyone remember one of them? Amina, what you have? A-L. Good, A-L, that says all. Does anyone remember another one? Solomon? A. A, that says a, uh, and then we learned one more. A-L, A, and one more. Harlan, what is it? Good, and B-E, that says B, like in because. So today we're going to learn the next two prefixes on chart 12. So I'm gonna show you the chart so we can be reminded of it. Okay, so we have E-N, that says N, like in enjoy, and U-N, that says un, like in unbutton. So E-N, N, U N un. So let's look at the board here and let's discuss. So remember, whenever we are marking a prefix in a root word, what do we do to the prefix? Circle it. Circle it. And then what do we do to the root word? Underline. Underline it. So would anyone like to do this word for us? Would they like to tell us how to mark it and read the word for us? Okay, go ahead. Um Go ahead, Hannah. E N. Okay, what is? Do you know the word? Enlarge. Enlarge. Good. Okay, let's try this one here. All right, go ahead, Josiah. Prefix E N. Prefix. Underline. And the word is entire. Entire. Good. Okay, next one. Let's go to you in that says un, like in unbutton. Okay, so Lyric, you would like to do this one? What do we do? You'll have to, oh, let me ask you to unmute. Oh, okay. Circle un. Root word hook. What's the word? Unhook. Good. All right. And on that last one, Harlem. On. On. What else? Underline the root word. What's the word? Untie. Good job. So we've learned A that says a, uh, A L that says all, B E that says B, and now we know E N N and U N un. So those are the five prefixes. We won't learn any more prefixes. These are the only ones that we are going to learn. So a prefix goes at the beginning of a root word. So we circle the prefix, underline the root word. Good job, guys, with that. So does anyone remember when we learned ABC order? It's when we put things in order of the alphabet. Does anyone remember? We have a list of words. What should we look at to determine the order of the words? Does anyone know? Okay, Hannah, I see you said, what is it? We, oh, good job. We always look at the first letter in order to put something in ABC order. Okay, so let me give you an example of, I'm gonna say two words. So we'll do two colors, just so we can review it real quick before we move on to the next part. So I have yellow and blue, and I want to figure out which one would go first in ABC order. So remember, ABC order means the order of the alphabet. So A, B, C, D, so, Looking at the two words, who think they knows which one would go first? We look at the first letter, we look at the Y and the B. Which one would come first when we say the alphabets? This should be super easy. Which one? Evan, which one would go first? B. B, so that means blue would be first and then yellow would be second. That is correct. So now we're gonna learn a different way to put words in ABC order. So look at my words here. I have bed, bat, and box. Now, if you look at all three of them, they all start with the same letter. So how could I put these in ABC order and they all start with the same letter? Remember, 
we had to look at the first letter in order to put it in ABC order, but it changes whenever they're all, they all start with the same letter. So since they all start with the same letter, do I just write them however, or do I still have to follow in a certain order? What do you think? Of course, I still have to do it in a certain order. So whenever a word starts with the same letter, guess what you do? You go to the second letter, okay? So that's only when words start with the same letter. So they all start with B, so I will look at the second letter in order to put them in ABC order. So I'll look at the E, the A, and the O. Those three letters will help me to determine which word will go first, second, and third, okay? Who, who understands? When they all start with the same letter, you go to the second letter because you can't determine it based on the first letter. So we have E, A, and O. So which one out of those three letters do you think would go first when we say the order of the alphabet? Which one would go first? Hannah. A. A, so the first word would be that because of the A. So next we have E and O. So when you say the alphabet to yourself, which letter will come first, E or O? Okay, um, Solomon, which one, E or O? E. e, good, so that means E would be second and then box would be last. So all of these started with the same letter, but we don't we don't pay attention to the first letter we do we go to the second letter and so we put it in order like that so anytime they start with the same letter go to the second letter let's look at some more words we'll practice a few more words so i have dish dump and dad okay those are my three words they all start with the same letter which is the letter d okay so i can look at the first letter so i go to the Second, not last, the second letter. So I'm going to cross out the first letter because I don't need this. I'll look at the I, the U, and the A. <clears throat> so looking at the I, the U, and the A, which one would go first? This one should be easy because... All right, let's see. Evan, so which one would go first? The A. Good, so dad would be the first word. Yes, okay, so then I have I and you. Which one will go next? Harlem? When you say the alphabet, which letter comes first, I or you? I, yes, so dish, and then dump will be the last one, okay? So we just put them in ABC order. So anytime, again, your words start with the same first letter, go to the second letter to put them in ABC order, okay? Who feels like they understand? I can tell that some do. I understand. Yes, okay. All right, good, I'm happy to hear that you get it. Okay, so that's our phonics lesson, guys. That's what we learned. Our other two prefixes, en and un, and how to put words that start with the same letter in ABC order. So you will do your workbook page after you were finished with our Zoom on today. You'll complete your workbook page.